Well, I'm here for CATV and we're lucky enough to have Australian all-rounder John Hastings with us at the moment. And uh, John, thanks for joining us to start with. And uh, it's obviously a long trip over from uh, Melbourne to Brisbane and then on to Colombo. Yeah, can you tell us about the trip? Enjoyable, not enjoyable? And who was the most annoying teammate on the way over? Yeah, look, it's always an exciting flight whenever you're going over to represent your country, I guess. But um, no, obviously it's very long. There's sort of things you just got to put up with. Um, there's a couple of people there on the plane that sort of weren't my favourite people that, uh, when they were coming over. I think James Pattinson is one that's, well, he's got some seriously, seriously bad flatulence at times. Um, I find it very hard to sit next to him and I, I couldn't really sleep because I was afraid of what was actually going to go up my nose there with what was coming out of his bottom, so that wasn't great. Very good, very good. Now this isn't your first time in Sri Lanka. You were over here for the ICC Cricket World Cup. Um, is this your second visit here? Yeah, yeah, look, it's my second visit over here. Um, we were here for about eight to ten days in the World Cup. Um, we had a couple of games, obviously, one against Sri Lanka, and there was the Pakistan game in there as well. Um, you know, very good place, Sri Lanka, I feel. Um, it's one of my favourites to tour on. Uh, you know, I'm coming over here, it's, it's nice and hot, it's you know, friendly people. You can get out of your hotel and you know, go and do some shopping and stuff like that, so it's always a pleasure to come over. Fantastic. And what about the Sri Lankan conditions? Do you think they'll suit your style of play, both bowling and that lower order power batting that we all look forward to? <laughs> well, I'm hoping so. Um, we had a, just finished up a training session here this morning, and um, you know had a, had a sort of a first look at you know, this season's sort of uh, wickets over here, and you know they seem to be if you can put the ball in the right areas and bowl a good sort of length, that you, know, you can get a bit of reward here. So. I'm hoping that my change-ups and my variations are going to you know, suit me well for this tour. Yep. Yeah. And you're here as a part of the as a part of the 2020 and the One Day squads. Have you set yourself any goals or ambitions for that time here? Yeah, definitely. Well, I feel that I'm still uh, trying to cement my spot in the Australian 2020 and One Day side. So for me, you know, after having seven games for Australia over here, hopefully that I can you know, sort of nail that bowling all-rounder spot down towards the lower order hit and, and obviously sort of first change and in the power plays and that sort of stuff so I'm, I'm hoping to cement that spot. Fantastic and I suppose now you've been lucky enough to spend probably 12 or 18 months in the Australian setup you've probably got to know people pretty well I, I know something everyone's very interested in is the most annoying of your teammates you spend a fair bit of time with the Vicks is there anyone there that really stands out? Yeah look there's a couple there um, you know obviously there's a few different states involved as well but um, you know probably predominantly you know, there's the captain of the 2020 team Cameron White he's got this annoying thing with his hair that he sort of he's like, oh, I can't talk about hair either but he's sort of losing it and he always sort of flicks it down in front of his face and, oh, and it just gets on my nerves at times and just, I, I feel I feel that I don't really need to be seeing that. That's absolutely brilliant, John. I don't know if you've done your chances of getting a game any good on Saturday and on Monday, but uh, good luck with that, and thank you very much for joining us on CATV. No worries, Logan. Thank you.